Shalom Akim. First and foremost, I want to give all praises and all glory to the true and living power, which is Yahweh Ba'ashem Yahweh Shai Ba'ashem Rakah Kodash. Yahweh is the true name of the Heavenly Father. Yahweh Shai is the true name of an only begotten Son, and there is no God beside them. And I want to give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, who definitely rule well, and who taught us his truth and honors and citations to the elect Akim, doing these works in sincerity and in truth. So, yeah, man, I just want to build off of a, a uh, off a point, man, that I was meditating on through the spirit of Pai Shai. And that's pretty much, man, you know, when we praying to the Lord for all certain things, you know, which this all goes for myself, first and foremost, which I had to turn into a lesson. You know, Lord willing to be edifying. You know, you know, when we praying for certain things for me, how about Shemal Shai? Asking the Lord for certain things. Well, you know, ultimately we gotta ask ourselves as well. Well, are we doing what Yahweh Shemal Shai asked of us? You know, that's like a you know a, a kid asking for a play for a PlayStation Five, but his parents asked him to clean his room. You know, it is, he didn't even clean his room. He's not even doing what his parents asked. But here he is asking for for things. Now, at the end of the day, you know, the your parents may may get it for you. All right? Or they may uh uh be strict and say, "Man, hell no, nah, man." You know? But the point is the best way to get something when asking for something is when we're doing what we're asked of, man. You know, so this is a revelation. <clears throat> Chapter three, verse 19 it says, as many as I love, I rebuke and chasten. Be zealous, therefore, and repent. Okay, so Yahweh Shai chastens us, man. So now, you know, when we ask to, to receive help, you know, Salaki, when we ask to receive help with the chastening, it's a better look when we're doing what he asked of us. Then the Lord, you know, can, you know, uh, uh, hey, then the Lord can let his will be done, so to speak. Well, that's why it says be zealous, therefore, because if we be zealous, you know, then we can be, then we can remain in good standing no matter what. Because you do have the whole Job, the Job scenario as well, when the Lord is just testing your, uh, your loyalty, because Job was doing everything good. But it could also just be straight up chastising, man. Because, you know, we we cannot be doing what the Lord asks of us. Or what the Lord, not even asking, really commandment, commandments, man. What the Lord commanded. But that's why if we be zealous, then we, we can at least knock that uh, uh, avenue out. If we be zealous for you, how about Shemel Shai and put the Lord first? It says, and repent. Okay. So let me uh, uh, search another one real quick. Yeah, man. This, 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 at the end of the day, man, this truth is the most vast, beautiful room to grow. That is known unto man. You know, somebody working at Amazon. <laughs> well, if you do good, there's a lot of room to grow here. You can well, shut up, man. Shut up. You know, this is where there's a lot of room to grow. You grow as a man. You grow as a as a father, as a son, as a man of the Lord. Any anything, man. Anything. 
this truth helps you grow in any avenue, man. Your diet, herbs. You know? So it's our Matthew 6. In verse 22, it says, The light of the body is the eye. If therefore thine eye be single, thy whole body shall be full of light. And going into one of these, one of the things that this truth teaches is diligence, man. Because, you know, if our eye be single, you know, keep our eye on the prize, so to speak. Constantly, you know, watching the Apostle and Elders of Great Millstone and, and the other brother and, you know, doing our own lessons and reading the reading our story, reading the stories of our history and the Bible, studying topics, man, praying, these, all these things that please the Lord, if we do them daily, you know, and keep with it, that's diligence, man. You know, and... Through diligence, man, that's going to please the Lord. And that's why this is the ultimate, it's the ultimate test, man. This place filled with distractions, okay? Spiritual demon Satan, trying to sift you as well. And then that's why chastise, man, that's why, you know, chastity is a beautiful thing, man. And it could not even be. Just a little, uh, uh, not even be nothing serious, you know, but it gets your attention, man. It, it, and, and it shows that your Habash Rasha exists. So this is Hebrews 11 and 6. It says, but without faith, it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to the Most High must believe that he is, and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. All right, and and that diligently seek him. So this is Isaiah fifty-five and six. It says, "Seek ye the Lord while he may be found; call him upon him while he is near." You know. Because the time is going to come where he won't be able to be found no more. So we got to seek him while he, while he can. And, and, and how do we seek him? By staying in the spirit. You know, once again, like the scripture, I brought out keeping that eye single. <clears throat> okay. Matter of fact, going back to a. Uh, What's that? Revelation 3 and 20. Behold, I stand. The voice of Yahweh Shai. Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come into him and will sup with him and he with me. See, so, hey, we see, hey, we, we looking out, man. We, you know, we seek, yeah, we seeking the Lord heavily, looking out the door. We know that he's going to, that he's coming at some point today. We should be so eager, you know, to sup with the Lord that we may we wait for him, man. You know, hey, in the form of being occupied in prophecies. It says, behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come into him and will sup with him and he with me. You know, so we got to make time for that, man. You know? Definitely got to make time for that, man, to, so that we can uh, grow in the spirit. It says, to him that overcometh will I grant to sit with me in my throne, even as I also overcame and am set down with my father in his throne. 